So what exactly does a hit 1984 song from Footloose have to do with increasing your senior portrait sales or attracting boys to your senior brand? That and a lot more on this exclusively for Shutter Magazine episode from Bloom Education. I'm Philip Bloom and welcome to Bloom Photography Studios. Uh, I want to talk to you today uh, about how to improve your senior business possibly twofold. If, if I've done my math right, boys make up half the population and a lot of our senior brands are only attracting girls principally. So if we can attract more boys to our brand through strategic marketing methods, uh, when we want to do that to increase our business twofold? Um, let me give you just a few tips. Let me start with a story though. Um, I, one of my earliest memories is sitting on my mom's lap and listening to her sing to me, let's hear it for the boy. You know, let's hear it for the boy, let's give the boy a hand. Um, hit song from the 1984 movie Footloose. Uh, but to me, that song was always sung to me as a son. Um, and so it was the, the perfect anthem for a mama's boy. And that's absolutely what I am, a mama's boy. Um, I, you know, so let's fast forward from my two-year-old, you know, on my mama's knee to just a few weeks ago, now I am somewhere in my 30s, old enough that I can't even remember, got three kids, um, and my mom just a few weeks ago actually tracked down my old school photographer and finally ordered my senior pictures. We couldn't afford those when I was in high school. Things are improved now, and now, um, only now, is my mom actually ordering my senior pictures. That's how important those pictures are to her. That is the product that you can offer to not only senior boys, but their mothers. So with that in mind, let's just hit, pick up these marketing tips. Um, one, I want you to consider direct mail when you're marketing to seniors. That doesn't always work for every type of client. Um, we can't mail out a bunch of flyers just hoping, hoping that one of them will end up at someone's house who's engaged you know, for a wedding uh, contract. But we can reach kids who are in school because we can go and use programs online to send out direct mail to households we know have children um, and those children become seniors. So if we send those out strategically, uh, chances are boys in those households and their mothers will see them and react to them a lot better than if you had just dropped off literature into the high school where boys tend to pick on each other if you know one of the group is considering senior portraits. They might get picked on, they might decide not to do it. If you can reach them at home though, then they're away from that peer pressure and that's the place to do it. Uh, secondly, consider stylized portraits. A lot of us, we're shooting seniors, we have our style, that's great. You want your branded style and you wanna be consistent. But consider just getting away from that a little bit um, as a way to attract a new crowd. If your photos are light and airy, uh, boys might be more interested in something a little edgier, uh, something that can show off sort of an extreme sports angle. So consider, um, Finding out, you know, sending them a questionnaire, finding out what they're into, what sports, are they in a band, are they into cars, and at least for a few pictures in your session, get out that off-camera light and start shooting something edgy. Uh, business partnerships have been great for us. Um, if you are, uh, if you want to jump from this video to my article this month in Shutter Magazine, March 2017, um, you'll get a sampling of not only our senior session on location, but also our senior headshots. Um, or high school headshots that are done right here in the studio because we've partnered with a nearby orthodontist. We've given them gift certificates. They give the gift certificates to their patients as a thank you at the end of their braces coming off. And those patients come in here for a free, short 10 minute session when we're able to introduce ourselves to them and it leads into senior portrait sessions. Um, that's a partnership that works for everyone. We're all scratching each other's backs. And then finally, think about your products. What works best? We just noticed trends as we have sold to girls versus boys, and um, we still stick to our core products, books, and enlargements. But we've noticed that boys prefer um, kind of more masculine, leather-bound covers, whereas girls tend to prefer photo design covers on their books. Um, and so when we're creating samples, we keep that in mind. And we make sure to create that sample that we show to boys when they come in, with a subject, someone they can relate to inside and that leather cover. Um, and the apps that are often popular 
uh, among girls, the mobile apps, personalized ones, are not as popular among the guys, but they tend to like prints, uh, maybe even with their, their sports stats and things from their team on them, almost as a trading card thing. They're, they're, they're young adults, but they still have that culture coming up of enjoying uh, trading cards and things like that. I think that's why they like those small prints better. So just pay attention to those things and customize the experience to your clients. Um, so when you're, when you're directing a boy, you might not have them doing all the cute things a girl would do, all those same poses. Uh, pull something else out of your bag. And if you'd like some ideas for that, what, how you can really direct a session, whether it's a grumpy groom on a wedding day or uh, a boy on a senior session, I invite you to download our big and popular ebook uh, from Pose to Playful, Snap the Jobs of Game. It's got all kinds of great um, just things to say, ways to direct your client, but also role-playing scenarios you can pull them through to create great and active images. Um, and you can download that at bloomphotography.com slash photographers in the photographer section of our website. So again, I'm Philip Bloom. Thanks for listening. And I hope you'll read this month's issue of Shutter Magazine. Enjoy it, guys. All the best.